Hi there and welcome back my friends to the Seekers of Nautilon in Snail Wars. We're preparing to have a conflict with the Tecarus Continuance. We've already made the claims. And now... Oh! And now we have another... <laughs> another criminal thing here from the Human Syndicate. Let's have a look. Yeah, 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 yeah. They are building their concealed drug labs here. Oh. What does this mean? It means something. It means we have to rework this thing with some precinct houses to get rid of it. Crime is a serious problem if you have the human syndicate on you. Definitely a lot coming. What do we have there? Yeah, that's ready. Trade hub collection range goes up and protection range with a hangar bay. So goes up, which is always a nice feeling. Let's have a look at our Citadel Bristol Station. Nautilon's chill system. Yeah, we've already sent the Mozambique here, as, as you can see, there's a new habitat coming here. Still, we're looking at everything. Can afford to just build around if we want so. So it's all nice and easy. Some of these are builds that we still have from the AI that took over. That's why they are sometimes don't make much sense. Like here, I mean, I really dislike the trade districts usually. Um, these at least. Yeah, look at that. The crime. The criminal syndicate branch office is there. Just barely keeping it in check. When the precinct houses come, everything will be much better. I mean, look at that. They are just increasing the crime. ex fold That's why we need the precinct houses here. Count Spiral Direct has leveled up to 6 now. Crazy good. Fortress Secundus has the temple, which is pretty good. I have something going here. Construction complete. What we're going for is we definitely want to have some uh, more wonders going. already had the wonders here that is complete fully made Dyson sphere the strategic coordination center site is here that's also running well and we could go for the decompressor site as well activate we could activate uh, the head of Sarkland again but mm, mm, construction complete I'm not sure it is needed right now as we're already pretty close to our naval capacity. I feel very strongly about these robots. They have forced us. Yeah, we, which robots? Yeah, I'm changing the topic again. These robots, the Tecarus Continuance, that fallen feet. empire, they are pathetic now and their fleet power is equivalent to us. So we're really preparing some conflict because... We have mastered a new technology. Who knows what they're up to again and, and there's a lot to catch here look at that that's all ring worlds mm, look at that. our leader lifespan goes up by five years we love that of course we don't want our leaders to die we have a very good leader too and we need more food for jobs also let's have a look at the leader to show you Skill 8 out of 10, pretty good. Investor with trade value and industrialist with monthly minerals bonus. 
That helps. The air crown prince Vladimir is a space miner. That doesn't help at this stage anymore. A recruiter, that doesn't help us, being pacifist. An eye for talent, well, that is good. That is good, definitely. And the air is already at age 121. Wins the Uber Snail. The Nothrid favors is age 202 right now, which is. Well, a lot. It's a lot. Mm, we could gain a little more, but mm, doesn't doesn't make sense. We should buy more food instead, which is terrible, but needed. Let's sell some of this. Keep us below losing resources because of too much. Now we have poison for persistence. That's where the human syndicate builds its drug labs. Mm, minus 60 crime. It will up this, of course, to the Hall of Judgment. It will minus 150 crime, and that will offset their efforts quite nice, nicely, I guess. Hundred ninety marks is also there. Very good. A lot of constructions are complete. Let's have a look if anything goes not so good here, but everything in a pretty nice condition. Well, maybe you could upgrade one mega forge here and give that two more habitation districts for a little bit more growth. I mean, we have enough minerals to do these kinds of funny things just on the side. Oh, 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 and now a diplomatic proposal. Wow, they want to give us tons of energy credits. Oh, we don't, you don't hear us saying no. I mean, when in doubt, we'll just spend tons and more tons of energy credits on alloys. That's always helpful. Let's sell some consumer goods too. And we'll have some leeway soon, look at that. Maybe we can start even the second mega structure here. We're in Candyland a bit. So definitely there's no doubt about it. Still we ha haven't got enough um, alloys for everything we want to do, so it's okay to sometimes spend irregular sums of money uh, on alloys. Oh, the ring world construction, yeah! That's also something. We're now ready to begin the colossal task of building the initial frame of our future ring world around the primary star, the asteroid frontier system. So we don't need that many minerals, so we can go for the ring world construction. The amount of resources and materials required to build this skeletal frame will be immense. And hundreds of thousands of our finest engineers stand ready to begin the process of dismantling the system's planetary bodies into matter, which can be used in its construction. We're making history. Let's have a look here. 10,000. Yeah, let's start that instantly. It's gonna be quite nice. Also, we want more edicts going I think and ambitions of course the architectural renaissance is already there and what could be nice the grand fleet the omnifarious acquisition is also cool I mean look at this nothing to be said we we have tons and more tons let's let's go for that the Grand Fleet and the Omnifarious Acquisitions, maybe not that necessary. Mm. Yeah, we don't need that at the moment. It's all good. 
That's giving us some more loys at least. Nordland's chill habitat is complete and ready for colonization. Let's get it going. Here we go. 200 influence. Isn't that another habitat that could be ready? Let's check. Get the benefits and we'll have more snails here maybe let's find out this mega structure is an asteroid belt minerals from jobs plus 10 percent max mining districts plus three mm. do we get that if we plant a an orbital here i don't really think so but we'll certainly try as we cannot terraform this See if we can build a mega structure. Another habitat would be quite fine. Let's see about the shipyard. Let's hopefully close uh, Inessa. That's that. That's just that has no orders. That's just there. Indonesia. That's getting infiltrated, so to say, and we're sending more out. Even through the gate. And let's build one more just in, in case. We also always want to have one of the ships getting ready. Nice fortress of the skies. Hmm. We can build two parallel uh, mega structures, but not more. Ring world site that's coming here, and where do we have the other thing? Metal compressors here, that's quite nice. But we also have the strategic command system here. System here. In Inessa, I think. Strategic Coordination Center. That'll be pretty helpful too. I feel it's kind of all good and kind of not so good, but certainly go for something if we have and look at that yeah we'll try to increase our naval capacity too now that we have the mega structures and a habitat going there's no reason not to use more alloys which means we'll try to use more alloys and a bigger fleet oh michelle wrench howard leveled up Always nice, it's repair guys and girls really making your life easier. Let's see what we have. We have Sartan's Crusaders here, and we could uh, is there something going on? I mean, um. They're kind of complete, but also not comp. Ah, yeah, we can add more battleships. That's something we should do. Let's 
So, let's reinforce the fleet. What's that? Crusaders. Construction complete. Would be nice. Don't know what to do yet with our habitat. No, look at that. The enigmatic cat is still roaming here. That's nice, of course. I mean, getting a lawyer is... It's the hardest thing. will be there. Let's see what we have here. The Hyun station. They're upgrading. Uh, Another office. The precinct houses need to be there. They're a plague, basically. Oh! Energy credits. We have to spend the them on something. Ten thousand food. I'm not sure. Ah. Too much candy land and high density munitions. Use ultra dense ultra dense slugs. They can punch even the strongest of projected shields. What else will we go for? Um. Planet build speed is nice in between. And now... Let's have a short look how anything goes. That's the human syndicate. They're actually pretty small. But they have a good fleet power. A strange connection to the Glossed Verheni Mercantile Guilds. They're boxed in, but they're pretty annoying. I'm at some point they will disappear, I'm pretty sure, but for now they make for a constant reminder reminder for us to add precinct houses to every planet. You can see the Sutherian technology is pretty pretty good. The outcasts though. Also very nice. They're kind of in a bad position because of the wars they had fought a lot. They had been the, one of the dominant empires, but alas, not anymore. And the Crimson Corporation is getting more, more dangerous, as you can see here. They are pretty good. It is really their dedication to self-improvement and, of course, fanatic materialism that's driving them forward. The fallen empires are doing nothing, they are just staying there. Let's see. Sutherians, they are also pretty nicely going forward. So all in all, we kind of control the galaxy, but um, not really control it. We're just the biggest and baddest out there now. Except for the fallen empires, of course. Or at least I think so, let's see. Yeah, indeed, and we're also part of the Galactic Horde, so... Yeah, the fallen are not really in their best in their best state right now. Maybe we'll have to do this attack we have mastered to a new technology. 
get something going to wake someone up. Shield harmonics, though, will help us too in the future. And um, actually, let's go for more of that as we've just sung Angliona Miman, who is an expertise in this field manipulation. How are old enemies doing? The Hisma Synergetics. They are not doing well at all, so. Let's see what's going on there. The Okla opened up borders, so it's like that. The um, diplomacy goes well as well if you have a bit of a fleet. The others are afraid of you and want to have good relations to you, so. I want to have good relations with you as well, so uh, thank you for watching and happy gaming to you. We'll see each other in the next episode and we'll expand the Megastructure Madness and maybe something will happen soon. I don't know, it might it might be another, another couple of episodes, but yeah, the, the date and maybe something, you know. See you soon, have a great time until then, and happy gaming. This is Immanuel Khan, signing out. Whoa, wait. The Vivi Sandia claims to have uncovered intel suggesting that we are building a secret launch platform for weapons of mass destruction. Now Ringworld and requests our permission to inspect the site. Our military advisors have yet to confirm whether it's an honest mistake or something more sinister. Either way, we should handle the situation delicately. Yeah, we can hold that for 20 days. Here, yeah, search it. We don't care. See you soon. It's gonna be good.